Look what's here. I'm so excited. Bright and early 7 a.m. Our, all of our crap shows up. Okay, it's tomorrow. We got a coffee maker a few days ago from Target for when we have guests over because the espresso machine's kind of complex. No, you're acting like I don't know how to use that thing. <laughs> so I have to Do use you? this. Do you? Yes. <laughs> you know how to use that? I just really like a pot of coffee. I know, some people do. Wanna go potty? Good morning, you guys. It's the next. Oh, wait, this is the new vlog. Wait, this is actually a new vlog. Never mind. It's not the next day. Big day today. We have a pack and prep vlog. Um, the pod got delivered. You guys saw I took a little clip, but our driveway sits at such an angle that he was scared to leave it. So he wanted to like bring a professional out to actually drop it. So they ended up actually taking the pod back, but I think it's supposed to come back this afternoon, hopefully. But um, big day, I have a lot to do. I need to get a video edited right away this morning and get that sent in. And then um, we're packing and prepping for LA because I leave for LA tomorrow with Revolve, which I talked about in the last vlog. If you guys haven't seen it yet, mom and I got our nails done yesterday, which I love them. Yeah, just getting ready. I wanna do outfit planning. I'm gonna do a huge Revolve haul in this vlog, so stay tuned. And yeah, just another day in the life vlog. I've been loving doing more of like the daily vlogs. So we're gonna do coffee and get the day started. I have the fire going. I've been sitting right there working and it's such such a vibe, <laughs> such a mood. <laughs> First thing, coffee. My mom's upstairs, she... Why is the coffee machine making that noise? I've been saving a bunch of stuff that I want to show you guys. Everything is from Revolve. Everything will be linked below. I always link my Revolve favorites for you guys below. So that's what I'm going to do right now, a little Revolve haul. And then later today, um, after I'm done like working and getting my errands done, I think I'm going to plan some outfits for the trip. I have like a few kind of planned out, but this whole box is full of stuff so i want to show you guys and share revolve you guys know the deal with revolve it's like my favorite go-to online website for online shopping because they just have so many different brands and the shipping and everything is great also it, it is on the price you're in when it comes to like certain brands but they do have some like a little bit more affordable options but the quality and stuff of their clothes is really incredible and i just find that there's like staple pieces that i find from there and i love for my closet so i'm excited to show you guys cute new little finds so i'm gonna start with like accessories and i have like bikinis i'm not gonna probably try the bikinis on today this is like just a bunch of accessories that i'm gonna show you guys um but i do have a collective bikini haul coming on my channel i feel like that's super requested over on my channel so i do hear you guys and i have that coming probably once i get home from la i'm gonna film that and show you and share with you like all of my favorite bikini brands and all that good stuff so i'm gonna sit down and show you all of this first up i'll do like i said i'll do accessories first so we've got a new pair of sneakers which i love sharing with you guys when i find good new sneakers so if you guys know i have the um veja i have these sneakers but i have the v in the black and then there's like black on the front and I've been wanting them in white. So I finally saw that they were in stock on Revolve. In my size, I get a size 38 and I'm like a seven and a half. Um, it says that they're a seven, but they run like half a size big. So super cute. Obviously I'm gonna lace them up, but these are really comfy sneakers. I love how the base of them is like an off-white cream and then these are like a stark white. So you can get away with wearing like off-white creams, like any really neutral color. And you guys know my thing is like, an all neutral outfit so these will match with a ton of things so i will link 
all this will be linked for you guys but what next oh i got a new black belt which i actually don't own any belts and i've been getting a lot of new jeans i had um shop alley grace sent me a few and so i wanted like a good belt that i could wear high-waisted with like a little baby tee tucked in and then some jeans and sneakers for like spring and summer i feel like that's really cute so i got this really nice quality black belt which i'm obsessed with and what i love about this one is that it's one size fits most i would say um there's so many holes and so you can wear it any like way on your waist you can do it super high waisted you could do it low on the hip so it kind of just fits any like area on my waist which i love because i feel like it's hard for me to find a belt these days that fits me super high waisted because that's like the smallest part of my waist so i'm really excited about this it's really cute have already tried it so i love that i want i'm like in the market for like a cream tan belt now because for some reason i'm all of a sudden into belts so thing of five face masks these are the loops face mask and i actually want to do one later i've been waiting to do them because i wanted to show you guys but i see a lot of people talk about these specifically danielle carolyn kind of sold me on them because she always wears them in her videos and they never like slip down her face she can like walk around and do stuff while having it on which was a game changer for me because i feel like they just like slide around when you have face mask on so it's really cute and i'll show you guys what they look like later because i am going to do one later but this is like the morning calls barely there sunrise service face mask really cute we've got the for anytime anywhere this is a weekly reset uh this one is a double take for nights out special occasions cute um this is a clean slate for daytime refresher full-time detox part-time facial i'll probably do this one today so i'm gonna put that to the side and then we've got this one is the night shift for bedtime so I think it was like 30 bucks for five of them, which isn't terrible, but just like a nice little treat to do for your skincare, add it into your nighttime routine, morning routine, whatever it may be. Okay, next up, I got, I got so many accessories, I feel like I never really do that. Um, okay, next we have a huge makeup bag, cosmetic case, travel case, whatever you want to call it and i saw this on the website and i was like i have to get this it's so cute it's the stony clover bags which revolve carries there's actually a stony clover store in nashville on 12 south i believe that's the street and it's so cute i went and walked around but i ordered this one off of revolve and i'm obsessed with it the inside's like a cute pink it has a gold zipper it's literally huge it fits it's going to fit so much and i'm so excited this is a really good gift idea um i actually got three of them because I'm gifting them to two people that I can't say because they might be watching this. So I'm gonna bring this with me when I pack. Um, okay, a few other little accessories. I got another pair of Bottega sunglasses. Um, when you guys use my links, you guys know it gets me commission for the website. So I just wanna say thank you again for using my links and shopping my links when I share um, my favorites and items and things like that. So I love you guys, but I got these and I'm so excited about them they're very different from anything i have and my favorite brand you guys probably tell is Bottega. i like love all their stuff but it's like this really pretty tortoise pair of glasses and then the side of them are really pretty it just has like the gold little it's like their logo for their glasses but they're just like really fun and different than what i have more of like a cat eye look and i love them so really cute um, really pricey, but they're really great quality and I love their sunglasses. I got this bag because I feel like I never have like a black bag when it comes to like going out outfits. Like all my bags I feel like are pretty like daytime-ish. And so I got this bag and I loved it because I love the green. I felt like it was different, but it's this little mini Alexander Wang like sparkly nighttime bag. And I love this so much. So cute. I have a top in here that I'm going to show you guys that I plan on wearing this with, with some like trouser pants for California. So really, really cute. Um, yeah, I'm just obsessed with this bag. Actually, I think I'm going to save the swim. Oh, I did get a beauty blender. This is at the bottom. This is my go-to. I always get these. Like I renew my beauty blenders every like probably like three-ish months because they start getting gross. But I think I'm gonna maybe save the swim haul for the video. So make sure you're subscribed because I have been collecting swim and sharing my favorites with you guys, and that's all gonna be in 
one video so um okay now we have like clothing which i actually like want to try on for you guys so let me get this put up and then i'll show you guys some outfits first up i have this really cute one piece i wouldn't wear these underwear with it i probably honestly wouldn't wear any underwear because it's very like a seamless little bodysuit and this is from the frankie's bikini active set you guys i am literally obsessed it's cut out on both sides you can kind of see so there's cut out right here cut out right here and it's really cute long sleeve so comfy i feel like this would look really cute with some ankle socks white sneakers that i just showed and then maybe like a big bomber jacket would be cute back has the little frankie's logo so cute i'm wearing a size small i love this and if you're not into like it really long you could always like kind of pull the shorts up a little bit but next up i have this little cozy outfit on from Alexander Wang. I'm wearing these little silk shorts. I ne probably need to do a small in these, but I got a medium because I wanted them oversized, but I think that the waist still is a little bit too big. You can kind of tell. And then this is like a cute little um, white crew neck. It's so soft and like kind of luxe. And it just says Wang on the chest. Really cute. I planned on like maybe tucking it, wearing some white sneakers, and then my Alexander Wang bag, which I thought would be cute but just like a comfy little cozy outfit i really love i didn't have like a white good crew neck and i feel like this is a staple for like spring so and then the crew neck i'm wearing a size large because you know how i do with oversized clothes <laughs> okay next up i probably wouldn't wear this outfit together i just needed to throw on a top to show you guys but this corset is from meow it's the same brand as the corset top that i wore in la my like literally one of my favorite brands that revolve carries pricey but you guys these are like the most flattering tops you guys can tell my boobs look pretty nice and it's leather really cute difference like a dark green and i thought i could do the green bag but then also these pants are so good um these are i don't know the brand but they're like this like obviously linen trouser pant i thought these would be really pretty for like uh summer and just like the beach and stuff like that really luxe nice pants and they're a size small i'm wearing a size small in this and i love this probably like i said wouldn't wear together but it's really really cute two pieces and this top is a halter another one of the corset tops from meow in this style corset i actually wear a size extra small just so you guys know for sizing just because it like fits me better right here but look at how cute this little cow print i think i showed this in an unboxing but i wanted to show you guys it on so cute i honestly kind of like it with these pants i feel like this could be a cute little fit with maybe like a brown bag so cute this is like the most flattering top it just fits so good and it's so flattering on so cute okay last little top from meow i'm wearing this in a size extra small as well and it's a really soft kind of like athletic feeling shirt kind of like the frankie's bikinis one piece and this is so cute it's cut out on the side so it's kind of like a little sexy with just being like a plain black tee i love this so much and then obviously the other side is cut out as well so this would be a cute little fit with some black heels for summer and i love this so cute i'm falling over this top from academy is also really really cute i probably would style this with maybe like some shorts i love the sleeves but honestly it's everything is like so cute with these pants what the heck obviously i would put some type of bra on with this maybe like sticky boobs or something but this really cute ribbed like buttoned open top i feel like this is really this style top is really in for spring and i just like love the sleeves and the detail it's also so comfortable i'm wearing a size small in this and it's so cute and i would again wear it with this maybe like some white sneakers and a little crossbody bag for like daytime would be really cute okay just a simple little cropped tee that has like a little half pocket right here um i got this in a size small it's from the brand hours i believe yeah just a good basic white crop i feel like i love to invest in like good basics because they're good quality they stay good for a while and again with these pants would be cute an all white outfit I love if anything you guys need to get these pants i mean my god they have them in so many colors too i want to like order the black i feel like i have so many pair of pants from zara like trousers and all this but these are super super flattering i'm obsessed with these okay next i have this pair of like track pants from annie bang i love these lily had these on in la actually and dressed them up with heels last revolve trip when we went for the super bowl 
and I love them so much. Track pants are super in for spring and summer, and I love these. I thought they were navy for a second, but they're black, little white stripe, and then the ankles do unzip. So like, if you wanted the little flare bottom over some sneakers or something, that would be really, really cute. Just like a white crop like I'm showing you guys. Oh my god, I look a mess, but probably wear these to the airport with some sneakers. Actually, this will probably be my airport outfit. Two more tops, I know this is getting long. We've got this long sleeve ribbed top from Danielle Guizio. I love this top, I feel like I've seen a lot of people with it on. It's just like a really nice like thermal fabric and I feel like since it's still kind of chillier at nighttime, this is really good for like early spring. Super cute, just like a different way to like do a long sleeve. It just like adds some detail if you're over like just like a plain long sleeve. And I feel like this is so like, so me, I love this top. Okay, last up, this little fit, which is literally me in an outfit. I am so obsessed with this. First up, the top is this really cute corset from Danielle Guizio. The sides are really cute. They like tie up on both sides. This side is untied currently. <laughs> and I'm wearing this in a size small. It's uh, like a creamy color and I love the like boning and the shape on these. And then these pants are incredible. They're like cut out right here so you can't really wear like high-waisted underwear or like really any underwear at all, honestly. But these are from the brand Breckenbridge, I believe, and I love them. They're like a charcoal, like not all the way black, but like a really dark gray. And I think I'm gonna bring this outfit to LA with some heels, like how stinking cute is this? I love this outfit so much, so. That's my little Revolve haul. Again, everything kind of, minus a few things, were a little bit more on the pricier end because I love to invest in quality pieces and I've been kind of redoing my closet, cleaning out my closet and just doing pieces that I know and I love. I'm just trying to like build my closet into like quality over quantity. So if there's something that you saw and you're like, oh my gosh, that, that was expensive or whatever, like those linen trousers, that's something I would totally save up and invest in because I, Every single top I tried on with those, I was like, wait, these would look so cute. So like, you just have to find those good pieces here and there. And I feel like Revolve is a great place to shop for items like that. So um, everything that I just showed will be linked. And then I'll also link my favorites. And I always put things in my favorites that I either have or that I know I want to buy or that I wouldn't, or that I would buy. I would never like add anything that I'm like, oh, I'm just going to add this because I think people would buy it. It's everything that I truly do love off the website. So I'm going to clean up the mess I just made and probably go make some breakfast. I'm like pretty hungry, but I wanted to show you guys my little haul. I'm gonna try out this face mask, the four day time refresher. Just like post travel, I feel like my skin always gets so dry anytime I'm traveling. So I'm gonna try to do like more skin prep than normal to get my skin ready. I remember last Revolve trip, it was a lot of like nighttime parties. So it was a lot of going out and a lot of makeup. I feel like this trip's gonna be a little bit more low key, which I'm really excited for. It's like a wellness trip, so that'll be really fun. Um, but I wanted to show you guys this mask because it's so nice. It comes in two, well, this is my first time putting it on, but I'm excited because it comes like this. And so you just do the bottom part and it's like a silicone, so it's really, I don't know, I just am excited to try it. So it just like, I'm having to bend down, but it just like literally goes on so good. It doesn't slip off. Oh my God, this is so good. Mom, look at this face mask. It's like a sheet, so it doesn't like slide down. You can like walk around with it on. What is this one? It's a face mask, uh -huh. but like, you know like the sheet mask where like you have to like go like this mm -hmm. on your face. Isn't that good? This one's for a daytime. I'm obsessed with this. Look at how good it stays on. I'm gonna go show Woody. Yeah, yeah. He's scared. Don't do that. Woody's gonna be freaked. Yeah. I'll Looks like this. I'm gonna leave it on. How long do you leave this one on? We need to go through all of these clothes. Ten minutes, but I normally like do a little bit longer. Probably go downstairs and make. I'm like kind of hungry. I am too. I need food. Maybe some guac. We have toast or anything. We have English muffins and we have salami and yeah. eggs. Put okay, this is a game changer. I highly recommend this face mask. Wow, and you can roll your face. Oh, yeah, this is living. L I V I G. Look at this. When mom's in town, she stays on top of the laundry. What are you the doing? <laughs> oh, you're stealing her. Winnie, look at mom. She's doing some self care. 
<laughs> Hi, Winnie. You're so cute with your haircut. Winnie likes Grandma's hair. I get to lay on Grandma's bed. Yeah, Grandma's bed is a uh, air mattress. <laughs> I just kept that face mask on for like 15 minutes while I was doing some emails and look at how glowy made my skin. It was really good and we're using some leftovers. We had like taco night last night so we're doing, uh, this is like what we had cut up. So we're doing just like lettuce wrap BLTs. My mom's making bacon. This is like one of my favorite lunches, like a lettuce wrap Basically BLT with no bread, it's so good. You can't hear anything now. Dad's like, what? <laughs> like, oh my God. Dad can't hear anything. No, to begin with. I'm gonna have a poppy drink with my lunch. I'm trying the, what is this one called? Ginger lime. It's really good. Isn't it? It tastes like Sprite. <laughs> you don't like it? So I like it. it's very, very refreshing. Mm -hmm. It's a fresca tasting thing almost. I love it. Because I can taste that kind of diet. Well, I love Sprite. Yeah. But I hate diet soda and I don't taste that at all. You don't? Mm -hmm. It's a very refreshing taste. I really like it. Wow. Yeah. Don't do that. It's a Winnie. The grand reveal already. <laughs> Cutest thing I've ever seen. I wish we had a dog room in our house. And I this is like so cute. It looks it is just really cute. Like her. I All right, mom. Started to unload the pod. Here it all is. Wow. Hey, Rach. Wow, the way that they pack some of this stuff is concerning to me. Rach, there was so much room in there. And then this we can put on the front. Yep. And then this is what um, goes under the table. Okay. We should lay that under that box. We could have packed a lot of this by ourselves. Well, I know, that's not like... But we need the guys to help get this stuff Absolutely. Out. I agree. But how, how heavy is that bike? Well, the bike is like, like, it's that's what crushed my foot. Like, it's like, you can't get it in the garage. Can you get it in the garage? Can you get it in the garage? Can you get it in the garage? I'm sure a lot of you guys know that. The bar and Bridget, she's the owner. She, I met her in LA when I went for the Super Bowl weekend with Revolve, and she has a clothing brand called The Bar. And she sent me an outfit for the wedding, and it's so cute. I want to take a picture so I can see it. That's so cute. But I'm gonna wear this, I think, in New York when we go get my dress, and it's the cutest outfit ever. And her stuff is sold on Revolve as well. Oh my god, it's so cute. Look at this top. Uh -uh. How cute Not. is that? And then you don't have to wear a bra and then you don't have to worry about it falling down. And it sits and it's like meshed to your body. Okay, And then Get these out. pants match it. Oh my god. Isn't that so cute? Like you have to. Because it'll be warmer. Oh yeah, it'll be May. And then these trouser pants are so beautiful. Oh my God, this is so cool. This is so cute. That was so nice of her. I have to post it on my story. I'll link them off of her website. They have a website and they're always restocking. And this is called the Lucene pant. I got a size four and then that's the Marcel top and I got a size small. So you guys will see it when mom and I are going into New York in May to pick up my dress. It's so cute. Isn't that cute? It's like so different. I mean, even though you see a lot of this, but the mesh with it. I know. Okay, so this is the packing situation. I think I've decided on checking a bag and then carrying this bag as my carry-on instead of bringing my Louis Vuitton duffel. I feel like I want to use this. I feel like hauling my duffel when it's super full is really heavy and tiring if I have like a long travel day. So I'm just gonna put like my nice bag and my nice shoes and then just like my laptop and stuff in here and just bring it onto the plane. 
So it kind of looks like chaos, but I think I have everything pretty much good to go. I just have pajamas, two extra little tees in case, and then I have daytime, daytime. I'm going for like five days, so I have a good bit of clothes with me. I've got basically my outfits all planned, kind of how I honestly tried them on for you guys for the Revolve haul. I have just cute little stuff. I'm also gonna probably bring that Zara set, which I've shown you guys in a Zara try on haul. And then I've got some swim. I've got a cute sundress. Here's some flats in case I want to be like comfy, but they're still kind of like dressy. And then we've got airport outfit. Denim shorts are always good to bring. And then I've got heels, sneakers, slides. And then I'm trying to decide on what bags to bring because I'm definitely not bringing all of them. I just want to make sure that what I bring is going to match most of my outfits. So I'm going to like kind of go through this and then try to narrow it down but i honestly think it's not that much for five days daytime and nighttime outfits i feel like i did pretty well i use these to pack i feel like i show you guys this every time but i freaking love these they're the cow pack brand but there's a set on amazon that are like 20 bucks for like six of them and they're just as good so i will link for you guys if you're not using packing cubes to pack it's like such a game changer they really help and they help kind of organized so then once you get to the hotel you can just like lay everything out separate everything and if you're someone who likes to unpack in the hotel and these make it super easy and then my luggage this small one is cow pack luggage i really like it and then that big one's just one for macy's but i'm in the market for like new suit like a new suitcase set so comment below if you have like a brand that you really like i'm trying to get new suitcases for like the honeymoon and stuff too hair before I get to a trip especially with the hair extensions so I always wash my hair before I leave for the trip style it blow it out all that and so then for most of the trip it's good and then towards the end of the trip I'll start doing like slick buns and things like that but this hair right now is like five days old so it is time to wash so I wanted to show you the stuff that I've been using a little three-step hair routine so first when I get in the shower I use this Amika purple shampoo and I just touch up like the front pieces, like a lot towards the front where my hair is super blonde just to get the brassiness out. I do this every time I wash my hair just because I, I don't wash my hair a ton. So I do this every time. But if you wash your hair like two or three times a week, just do this once a week. I love this stuff. It keeps my hair like really ashy and really like a good blonde color. I get that at Sephora or you can probably get it on Amazon, honestly. And then the shampoo and conditioner that I use, I freaking love this stuff. I've been using it for like half a year now, honestly. The Orbe um, Repair and Restore shampoo. Pricey, but so worth it. Again, if you don't wash your hair a lot, this lasts me like months. So this is the shampoo and the conditioner. I used to get at the salon that I would go to in Colorado and they do have an online website, so I'll probably still order from them. I'll link it, um, but you can also get it from like Nordstrom and places like that. So love, this is my little hair care routine, if you will, but I love doing this before a trip because it just makes me feel like fresh starting off the trip into the week and then once it gets a few days in, I'll start doing like low buns and things like that. Got my rug here, the pods here like you guys saw. My mom and I moved the table out of the way. They actually just called, they overnighted the part so this is gonna be set up tomorrow. So when the movers are coming to unload the pod, this will be set up. Also the chair in the corner is coming. My mom and I also took this out of the pod just because it was like right at the edge. And look at how cute, you guys. Look how cute is this? I'm obsessed with it. And then the chair for, ignore the mess. These aren't staying, we're just using them for right now. Um, the chair for this corner is coming. So a lot of house updates will be here when I get back from LA. So I'm excited to show you guys all of that. But I'm gonna get this rug out. So then when the people come to do the table tomorrow, it's all ready to go. And I think, 
Mom! Hey, Mom! <laughs> I have to tell you something funny. <laughs> you know that cable in it throw you put on the couch? What is it? It's my Christmas tree skirt. <laughs> Now that my hair's been dry, it's been probably like 40 minutes, so I let it like towel dry mostly because I like to put heat on it for as least amount of time as possible. I guess I'm like showing you guys a little hair care routine. So I use this Unite 7 Second Detangler. I've been using this for months. I love it. I get it from the place that I order my shampoo and conditioner from the salon I used to go to. I'll link their website. They have like a online store. You can shop all their products. And I use a lot of it because I have a lot of hair and it also acts as a heat protectant. So I use that and then I use this wet to dry brush, which has so much hair in it that I need to clean out. Ew. I'll use this wet to dry brush and then I'll use this Tangle Tees um, little comb to perfectly part my hair down the middle. And then I'll honestly let it air dry for even longer before I blow dry it. Um, on days that I'm in a rush, obviously I have to blow dry it right away, but if you're just hanging out around the house, I love to do hair wash day on days like today while I just have like a slower day while I'm around the house so I can do not a ton of heat. But that tangle spray is really, really good. And then I just take this brush and go right down the middle. I feel like it's harder to get a perfect middle part than people think. You know, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna get all like my cosmetic stuff together while I let my hair air dry a little bit more. Um, I'm gonna bring this bag right here. This little hanging case. I got this off Revolve and then also the Stony Clover bag, the big blue bag, big blue bag <laughs> um, as my two like bags for the trip and what else is skincare but i normally always like throw that stuff in last because i do need it for tonight obviously hair is blow dried and i'm going to curl my hair i use the bioionic i feel like you guys have seen me use this curling iron so many times so i'm not going to show you but i can also link my hair tutorial down below it's like a few months old, but everything's still the same and my hair is just a little bit shorter, but I freaking love this curling iron. I get it off of Amazon and it's so good. Update here. We've got the four chairs. We've got the rug. We got took this out of the pod and I'm so excited. It looks so good. We're just waiting on the table. Hi, Winnie. <laughs> um, but I'm so excited. I just got ready for dinner. Um, did my hair and everything like I was telling you guys, but I'm actually going to meet Julia and Hunter havens for dinner which is so exciting they live in nashville you guys probably all know and love them they're the sweetest cutest people and i'm so excited to like finally meet them in person and hang out and talk and have like a uh i was gonna say familiar face but like we've never met but like someone around town that does what i do and things like that so i'm really excited to like go have dinner with them dylan is actually meeting us but he's running a little bit behind at work so he might be a little bit late to dinner which is fine um they picked the place i think it's called nada i don't know if that's exactly how you say it but it's like a cute little mexican place so i am all ready to go yeah i'll show you guys my little outfit i'm trying to get this stuffing out of this purse because i want to take this purse i'm wearing the most gorgeous silk set from a store called tula the store that gave to me the stuff in fort collins and it's like a really luxurious silk set that I'm wearing and I'm so obsessed with it but I'm gonna change this purse over this purse actually fits like way more than I thought I'm gonna do some gloss a little vlog camera and I'll show you guys my outfit really quick mom's gonna stay home and watch Winnie girl I moved your car from the driveway thank you on dog duty Winnie she looks so funny over there. 
Okay, so I'll show you guys. I'll do it right here. It's bright. So this is the little set. It's just like a black silk set. It's like a really, like it's 100% silk. It's a really, really nice quality brand. Um, but it's from Tula Boutique. I'll link their Instagram below. You can always like contact them for specific pieces, but they do have like an online store. And then I also wanted to show you guys, I'm wearing this like, this is a Skims bandeau, which is such a good idea for a little top underneath. You can always like button and leave it kind of open or leave it fully open like I'm doing. And then I'm just wearing my black and white Veja sneakers. And then I'm gonna carry my bag. So I feel like my hair always looks like kind of weird the first time I curl it like fresh curled hair, but here's a little fit and I'm excited. Very excited for dinner and I think it's cute. So, and then we'll come home, finalize packing up and I'll see you guys in LA in the next vlog. I just dropped Dylan off some clothes. I'm about to park in the parking deck. We're going to, I don't know if I said it, we're going to a cute Mexican restaurant. I've never been over in this part of town, so I'm like excited. I was like, you guys pick, you guys are pros, you know where to go. And Dylan and I are like lost puppy dogs in this new city. Um, so I don't know if they've tried it before, if we're both trying it for the first time. Just a piece of hair on my eye. But I turned on the camera because I wanted to say that there are so many freaking cute girls in Nashville and they dress so cute. And I just feel like I can like express my style more and my fashion and the clothes I wear and like be more bold with my outfits when I'm here, like for dinners and stuff, just on like, an average day-to-day -day night because there's so many cute girls walking around like i'm sitting at a red light and i saw this group of girls and they were like so dressed up for it to be a tuesday night and they just all look so cute and i was like i feel like i would never do that in colorado because everyone there was like either older or the fashion there just wasn't like how it is here and so i just wanted to say how excited i was to like be bold with my style because i have so many cute pieces i just always am like oh i'll just dress down for dinner because like i don't want people to look at me so i need to stop being like that and i wanted to come on here and say that because i was like i feel like a lot of girls feel that way and we need to stop feeling that way and we need to wear what we want when we want because we have cute shit you know and we need to wear it because we'll look cute so thought i would say that i need to put my camera away because i'm trying to park but i'm excited to eat dinner i'm so hungry this is the restaurant right here. I think it's actually, um, it says coming soon, but I think that the buildings above are, is this a hotel or apartment? I think it's a hotel. It's really a cute area. There's like a ton of restaurants behind this too, but the restaurant we're going to is right here on the corner, so cute.